The TiVo Michelangelo is a compact and solid desktop 3D printer capable of producing high quality prints. The main body is of metal construction with the power supply and main board housed inside. It has a print height of 150mm and a bed size of 150 by 150 Although it doesn't use a heated bed, it is still possible to achieve good quality prints. The printer uses a Titan extruder to feed the filament to the 0.4mm nozzle and has dual cooling fans either side to cool the print layers. All three axis rails are made of aluminium extrusion with all metal components that hold the stepper motors, bed plate, hot end and extruder. The Michelangelo printer utilises inductive proximity sensors for the end stops for a precise zero homing position. The printer is very well built and a solid desktop machine. For the setup, the printer comes 95% pre-assembled and well packaged with foam padding. In the box there is also a USB cable, SD card, power cable, tools, a factory printer calibration cube, display dial knob, rubber feet and an instruction manual. The only components that are required to assemble for the printer are the installation of the four rubber feet to the base and adding the control knob to the front panel by pushing it in place. Whilst checking over the printer, I noticed the x-axis belt to be slightly loose. It's a quick adjustment to add tension by loosening the two bolts on the back and then applying some tension to the belt and re-tightening the bolts. Next is to plug in the printer and power on by the switch located at the back. On the front there is a small easy to read display with a rotary knob with push function to navigate through the menu. Before the first print we will need to check and set the bed level. This is done by selecting home all then leveling each corner of the print bed. For this I use metal feeler gauges and set the gap to 0.1 of a millimetre. The next step is to select preheat from the menu and insert the SD card with the pre-sliced file. Once the printer reaches temperature Hold the lever on the extruder and feed the filament until it reaches the nozzle. Select the file and begin the print. The first print is a vase that is printed in PLA and straight onto the print bread surface. Without a heated bed, the print still managed to hold in place, although it was only just attached by the end of the print. The print and the quality of the final item was super smooth with no visible defects or issues. For the next print, I added blue masking tape to aid in the print bed adhesion. Once again the printer worked well and printed a high quality item which was firmly attached to the print surface. I continued to use blue tape on the print bed for all other prints and had great results. As a small desktop machine the TiVo Michelangelo is a well built 3D printer. It is a portable compact design and easy to set up and use. It has great performance with quality prints out of the box and at an affordable entry level price. <laughs>